at Porter's Camera. Today I want to talk about the D3200 Digital SLR from Nikon. This one's different from the 3100 in that now we're going from 14.2 megapixels up to a 24.2 megapixel imaging sensor. Okay, that's going to allow for us to crop more extensively and retain detail. Or you can print posters that are going to look outstanding. Uh, another difference is going to be going from the XPEED 2 imaging processor on this piece to the XPEED 3 imaging processor. That's the same one, guys, the same engine that's running their flagship D4 digital SLR. In terms of speed, too, we go from 3 frames per second image capture up to 4 frames per second on the D3200. On the back of the camera, the LCD screen goes from a 230,000 pixel LCD up to a 921,000 pixel LCD. So we'll have better clarity when we're reviewing our pictures on camera too. Um, a couple other advancements we're going to find is going to be in the video recording. Uh, we now are shooting at uh, 30 frames per second at 1080 instead of just 24 frames per second. They're bringing in the ability to shoot in slow motion too and you can edit the video in the playback mode that's new we're also gonna pop on a microphone jack uh, so you can plug in the me1 uh, boom microphone from nikon for better audio or maybe grab like a i'm using a lapel mic here to, to you know rig sound for your video clips what else uh, cosmetically not a lot's changing with the camera they're going to move a couple buttons around the video recording button which used to live on the back is going to get moved up by the shutter button then the main command dial is going to remain the same though, uh, and that's what I like. They're going to even keep the guide mode, and the guide mode is my favorite feature on the 3100, but they're enhancing it on the 3200. What happens in guide mode is it asks you questions. What do you want to do? Set up your camera or take pictures? Well, I want to take pictures, and it says, okay, you want the easy way or you want to get fancy? Well, I want to get fancy. Now, the difference between this layout on the 3100 and and uh, what they're adding to the 3200 is now they're going to bring in what they're calling example assist images. So when you choose the effect you're going for, you're going to see an example image of what it's going to look like when, when you select that. Also in the automation of the camera, when you're using just the fully automatic mode uh, or the fully automatic mode with no flash operation and you're using live view, and the live view switch by the way is going to move down to the bottom, um, it's also going to use scene auto selector. So live view and automatic mode and it'll be picking for you portrait mode, landscape mode, nighttime portrait mode, uh, etc. So yeah, what else do we got? Oh, the addition of this thing. This is the WU-1A wireless transmitter device. What it's going to allow for you to do is when you're taking pictures, you can then send that picture to your mobile device. So a, a smartphone or a tablet, you can zip those onto your phone or your tablet to email it or put it on the Facebook, do that kind of thing. But another trick is going to be uh, you can use your smart device to activate the shutter too. And I suspect probably the video using live view. So I can see an application for that even with our pro shooters. You can set this up as a B camera over in the corner, right? And you're shooting with your D4, D300, whatever you got. But you can pull up your D3200s uh, and see what it's looking at and go ahead and start recording a movie or take a shot from its angle. So that's going to be pretty cool. Now it's going to be set up, I think, at launch, uh, ready for the Android devices with iOS coming out later uh, in 2012. Yeah, so I'm trying to think if there's a, you know, those are the main components that are going to be, uh, in my opinion, the coolest assets to this D3200. If you got any other questions, you know, go ahead and give us a buzz here at the shop or check out the specs on our website. We're already uh, set up to take your order, so... Uh, yeah, I hope this helps. If you got any questions, yeah, you know where at. Thank you. Have a good day.